it's currently Christmas Eve, and I wanted to make a message regarding holidays, but I wanted it to be a little bit broader than simply Christmas, although I do feel like the stretch from Thanksgiving to New Year's is particularly worse for many people regarding holidays than some of the other special occasions throughout the year. There does seem to be a particularly large difference in this particular season, and one of it is that it's the period of time with the longest nights, which can add with issues of seasonal affective disorder. But the reason that I want to make this message is because of the people that do struggle with this time of year. And I'm not exactly myself a big fan of holidays. And I've had plenty of my life where I'm subject subjected to the concept that there's something wrong with the fact that I don't like one day to be esteemed above another. And I would prefer that Tuesday be simply Tuesday instead of Christmas. And I would prefer that Thursday in November be simply Thursday in November and not Thanksgiving. And it would be nice to have Sunday in spring rather than Easter, just as a few examples of the more prominent holidays that are associated with other things such as family gathering. I really don't feel like the arbitrary differences that is it, it's a disruption for many different kinds of people. And not everyone enjoys the change. Not everyone likes things being different. A lot of people, the routine is what helps keep them stable. Um, many, For many people, having one day be as predictable as the next and just having it be a routine, having it be the, just the same as it was the day before as far as regular weekdays and a regular schedule is one of the things that helps keep them emotionally stable, uh, helps keep them uh, on a routine that is beneficial. It brings a sense of comfort as well with things being generally predictable. Other people, predictability is boring, it's dull, it's uninteresting, it's not adventurous, but there are plenty of people out there that the disruption that especially happens in this Thanksgiving to New Year's period is very difficult to endure. And it can be rough. And, you know, especially as combined with seasonal affective disorder type issues, just having less daylight, weather being colder in many areas. Um, there's those adjustments to make to begin with, and then the disruption in, in how things go during this particular season can make things extra challenging. And so while there's so many messages out there saying how this is a season of joy and this is the, the time to be giving and to rejoice, I want to make a message for the people that are just thinking, let's get through this. You know, this is not joyful. This is not pleasant. This is a disruption. This is difficult. This is challenging. Um, you know, so whatever it is, whether it's maybe someone or many someones in your life that you'd be wanting to spend this time with and can't, and you feel that sense of loss and grief, or maybe it's the arbitrary standard where you're supposed to be 
magically incapable of getting angry just because it's Christmas when that's just difficult and it's stressful and piled on top of it is this extra high expectation that's not there on any other day. That can really be awful to be held to a standard that you know you can't maintain. And to know that you're going to receive condemnation for your failure. And that can make people at this time just wanting to avoid social family interaction and friend interaction that they would otherwise seek but avoid because there's an arbitrarily high standard because it's a holiday. It's a special occasion. Oh, you can't be that way or maybe it's an expectation of being enthusiastic and celebratory when that's just not even in your nature you're perhaps a kind of person that just doesn't really express yourself in loud and physical manners and maybe there's an expectation that you behave that way when that's not how you behave. There's just so many things that come during this time of year and they pile on and pile on and come together. And for so many, this is a terrible time of year. This is an awful time of year. This is not a season of joy. This is not a time of wonder and enthusiasm. And so I just want to make this message there for people that feel some need to connect to the fact that, yeah, sometimes it's okay to think that the holiday sucks. You know, it's fine. And more than that, it's almost over. We're almost through it. We've almost made it. It's as quickly as the arbitrary standard was imposed, it will be taken away. There is, a, there is an end, and the end is in sight. So whatever you got to do, you can get through it. It's going to be okay. It's just a brief period of time. You can close your eyes and focus on taking long, deep breaths in and out. And just try and let it go. Or put on your favorite Fuck the World song, whatever it is. Get through it. The end is near in a good way. We're almost there. We can do it. We can make it.